Hello everyone, I'm Kaiser Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here, of course, in Hearts of Iron 4, Kaiser Reich, playing as the German Empire after we integrated the United Baltic Duchy into the German Empire. So, last episode we had some pretty major naval battles, which I'm really proud of our fleet here, especially Rolf. Look at that, level 7 skill, 6, 6, 4, blockade runner, concealment expert, minesweeper, and smokescreen specialist. What a guy. What a champ. Cool. So what, are, what is everyone else doing? You guys are repairing. You guys are repairing. Everyone is, and their grandma is repairing. So, last time I might have lost a few tanks in Sweden. <clears throat> Just a few tanks, you know, it is what it is. The French, French Republic is definitely getting kicked out of France. Uh, we're just holding the line here in Italy for now, which is fine, whatever. And, oh, we're still trying to see some convoys, which is awesome. So, here's my goal. Because the line with the communards has really not moved at all, and it looks like we should be pretty stable here, my goal is to knock out the Russians. That's probably the one goal that we have, is just to knock the hell out of the Russians, get them out of the war as fast as possible. That's pretty much where we're going to have to be at. Oh, we just lost an allied convoy. Well, not, not an allied convoy, but an important convoy, nonetheless. That's the goal. Take out the Russians. I don't know if we can... Oh, and Azerbaijan has just been annexed. Which means we can't do this. Because we were relying on their fuel. Uh, that sucks. That sucks so much. Uh, but at this point, you can't really do much here. So, yeah, actually, you can't do any of this stuff except for this part of Romania. And Romania's already gone. So, actually, doing this focus does nothing now. Or at least in the moment. So, research time. Do we need more materials? Aluminum, metal. Tungsten, chromium. We could use rubber. That's all we need. So no, <laughs> we're not going to do that one yet. Um, reactivate the Ludendorff, Ludendorff line, Lina, Lina. Well, uh, nuclear tech. I want to get better tanks. I have. Oh, get better tanks. We get some synthetic refineries. I'll put plus one rubber. That's nice. But we don't even have synthetic refineries yet. God dang it, AI. Why'd you do this to me? Uh, let's see. Mm, Air Force is okay. I just thought. Tanks. I mean, they already went down this path. I have a new doctrine, but, you know, whatever. Ah, uh, let me double check this. So, that's infantry weapons, Mauser contracts. Those are nice. Krupp steel. Subsidies for Siemens. Infrastructure, infrastructure. Civilian factories. I'm probably just going to go with Krupp steel. Well, that's not bad. Economic resurgence. Kaiserreich economic policy. Oh, Christian trade union for a little bit more output. That'd be kind of nice. And a little bit more stability. You know what? Let's just do that for now. So, by founding the Deutsche Christlicher Gewerkschaftsbund as a state-endorsed union, we will hopefully establish a bulwark against attacks on the workers' loyalty from the left and right. Workers will be able to voice their concerns under the moral authority of priests and the guiding hand of the Summus Episcopus, the Kaiser. Ah, yes, Kaiser. Yeah, thumbs up for the Kaiser, everyone. Thumbs up. Um, you probably aren't winning because you guys could actually probably do that. Maybe could you just at least push those Russians out now? There's going to be more Russians on the front just because Azerbaijan has finally capitulated. Which means we're going to be really, really out of fuel soon. Except from Iran. Thank you, Iran. Uh, I don't mind getting six fuel from Swedish state. How much further do we have? Two, okay. Even though I really still need to keep doing naval doctrines. Because that's, I think, re really important. But we just sunk another two carriers. Improved carrier, whole carriers. That's awesome. That's really, really awesome. Alrighty, Iran. I just wanted what. Ah, oh, 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 Iran. Why? Why, Iran? <clears throat> cool. We're still winning down here against the Finns. Great. And we're at least going to have one tank division with us. Subsidiary carrier role. Great. More organization. More organization. I would love to keep doing that. We're doing that, which is awesome. We could honestly probably use fuel refining three. It takes so much time, though. But there's still some infantry stuff we have to do, like this. Hmm. And you know what? I need tanks. I really, really need tanks so I can make a push somewhere. Because even though we were, we're still using tanks, they're only 1934 level. I think for now, though. <clears throat> Ooh. <clears throat> Resource efficiency gain. Hmm. That's not a lot that we're extracting. So, every fuel counts. I'm going to go with this. It takes long to do, but whatever. And I'm going to get. I'm probably going to use heavy tanks. If it becomes a 1941, I'll probably use heavy tanks. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ooh. 
Good, we got more guys with artillery and engineers. Awesome. <clears throat> I really don't plan on us moving this front too much. I mean, I guess technically I could try an invasion of the Union of Britain, but we're already on three fronts, which wouldn't be very good. <clears throat> Excuse me, I don't know why I'm, I haven't played my voice all this time. Oh, well, whatever. Do that. Cool. So, we're still winning in some areas. Some areas. Come on, at least push him out of the Ukraine here. That's a good goal to have. Uh, you still might be able to win. You might be able to win. Just support the attack. Don't do very much else. Nice. A Russian sub. Great. Alright, so we freed these guys. And I don't want these guys to get killed off like what happened to the last group. We're going to help attack. And you know what? Tanks are made to be used. Let's see if we can circle those guys. See what you can do about that. Alright, good. Next up, some Mexican convoys. Come on, guys, just win. Just win. Really good use it. A good win here. A good W. Oh, you guys are doing well. Cool. Help them out, help them out. You push in, you push it, you help attack. It's just, it's just a small little advance. Just a small little advance. And I need to spread out my line a little bit more, too, as well. Reactionary uprising crushed in Brazil. Disaster was averted. Oh, boy. And the CSA is going to win the Second American Civil War. That is not good for us. That is very much not good. I can't believe Canada just let them win. That's on Canada, man. Oh, look at that. What's going on here? Alright, what are you guys up to? Still repairing, Jesus. Y'all love repairing. Nice. We actually won there, and can we hold the lands from three white Ruthenian or white Russian divisions? Come on, get in there. And we did. Great. Oh, we also convoy. And we sunk a couple enemy convoys, which is what is important. And what is going on here? Alright, so we found the enemy remnants of the enemy fleet from the Union of Britain. What are you guys doing? Seriously, what are you doing? Where are you going? Why are you zero out Oh, you're engaged. You are engaged with a couple of subby boys. Did you throw everyone in here? That seems a bit... Yeah, you did throw everyone in there. That seems a bit excessive. Cool. How is the front looking? No wonder you can't help anyone else out. Let, let's let our guys move around first. I want more of the Ukraine... I was going to say, I want more of the Ukraine to collapse, so it's a little easier for us to manage our armies. And come on, Bulgaria, you, you, you beat the Serbs. Can you beat the Greeks? Can you beat them well? Oh, we're running out of fuel. That's so not good. Nice. Good stuff, good stuff. Could you do that? You should be able to. Could you move up? You should be able to. Could you not move? and help beat these guys up. These guys are moving up. That's good. Take one division. Come right there. Uh-oh. Oh, we lost four destroyers. That's not optimal. That's really not good. Good. More convoys. More convoys. Always delightful to sink more convoys. And they are attacking there. You know, I don't mind attacks. But you gotta be a little bit more careful, man. You gotta be a little more careful. Throwing in those five divisions should be good enough. Oh, we only... Oh, it's Pasha. A Pasha is trying to attack. I'm like, why are we still losing? Oh, God, we're out of fuel. That's not good. German East Asia, please. Thank you. Arabia? Yes. Yes, thank you. And, of course, they joined the Third International, because why not? God dang it, the stupid AI didn't make any fuel whatsoever, which really kind of hurts us. Of course, they joined the war. Makes sense. Oh, we need to make sure we get some uh, manpower, too. That's important. Hmm. One guy here. We really have France under lock. Let's see. Ooh. Oh, we can raise our conscript. Oh, yes, let's do that. Occupied territories are looking pretty awesome, including Belgium. Let's see. Oh, wait, I don't want that. I want... Spy stuff. 
we want? Prepare a collaboration. Uh, prepare a collaboration government for France would be good. There you go. You look pretty awesome, Emil and Heinrich Schmidt. Yes. Very good. Very delightful. Alright, so we have even less fuel now. Don't do anything, go home. This is really cutting into ourselves. Here, this is really not good. Portugal's doing a great job, though. Oh, and the Russian Navy might be out here, too. If that's the case, do we have any other naval bombers? We got some close air support, that's good. Anything else, though? Interwar fighters, strategic bombers. Oh, man, not really. That sucks. I might use these guys as naval bombers. Because I have nothing else. I mean, I have a few naval bombers, but I need to save those for the other naval bomber wings. Alright, cool. Cool. Franz Heidler. He's having a time. Unfortunate, unfortunate. Oh, they're trying to break out. Or something. Cool. Very awesome. Very awesome. Two more divisions. Go bye bye. Oh, they threw in some more divisions here. That's not good. Uh, it really sucks fighting without fuel. It really sucks. Hmm. At this point, I can't really argue with how much or how little I get. Three. I guess I can get three, but that's not very much at all. Come on, research faster, guys. Research faster. Another three months until we can get more fuel. That's insane. Oh, cool. I'll take everyone but you. Push. Same level support. Cool. Yeah, both of you. Yeah. Alright, Austria. So, what is Austria doing? Could you join the war against the Third International? That would be great. Yeah, they obviously went with, went with status quo. Approaching Albania, intervention. Old friends in Bulgaria. Austrian stuff. They've done none of this. Hmm, must be a decision they might take eventually. Oh god, what happened here? We get... Yeah, actually, deploying those planes probably wasn't a great idea since it does take more fuel. Which is something we're lacking quite a bit of. You guys are attacking. You guys are winning right there, which is awesome. Next up, we're going to attack... Actually, can you guys get right there? You can. So, okay. one guy. Hold. Actually, no, send everyone there. The Ukrainian division will hold well enough. That's what matters. Cool. Hmm. Anywhere else along the line? Can we move? Oh, you actually took a piece of Russian soil. That's actually really good. Really, really good. Now, these guys look like a cancerous wart on this area. And, of course, our agent was captured. God dang Frenchies. Nice. Oh, oh boy. Okay, where, where, where's my fleet? You guys are here. You have, there's four of you ships. Four fleet task forces. Where are you? You have to help out. Oh my gosh, you're just gonna let our screen get sunk. Then again, they don't have fuel. So I guess that makes sense. Send, oh my god, send, that's a lot of aid to the Ukraine. Jesus, but at least that'll be over soon enough. Oh my goodness. Uh, let's go rescue our captured agent. Uh, there it is. There he is. Cool. What is our guns like? So we got plenty of guns, we got plenty of artillery, which is actually really, really good. Hmm. We got guns, we got artillery. Panzer Division, bye bye. Uh, let's see. Ooh, Grand Assault, nice. Nice, that's, that's good to get, that's good to get. Yeah, this is looking pretty trashy. You know what? If I have Mountaineers, we're gonna make them big boys. We're gonna make them huge boys. These are gonna be the thickest German divisions that we have so far. Minus some of the other divisions that we have so far. <laughs> Since we have the surplus of guns. Oh, that's too much. Ooh, guns and artillery. Just do that. Makes it easy. Engineers. Awesome. Oh, whoops. There you go. Now that's awesome. Great. That shouldn't hurt us too much. Awesome. Let's grab... Ooh, infiltration or assault. I never go down grand battle plan. Overwhelming fire max planning. A little more... Just a tiny bit more organization. Army breakthrough is always good. 10% more breakthrough. I like that a lot. Leg infantry gets breakthrough, but... Army breakthrough is just... That's for everyone. Infiltration. Armored cars. Tanks armor recovery rate. Less supply consumption. 
I like the less supply consumption. And recon gets more recon? It's not bad. It's not that much recon, though. Hmm, land out attack. Planning is okay. Just lots of planning. I don't want to plan. Infantry offensives. Probably a bad idea, but whatever. Seriously, you let our ships get destroyed. Finally, now you show up? Then you're not even fighting the other, the correct fleet. <clears throat> whatever. Let's see, 12 more divisions? Cool. Throw them on the Russian front. Uh, nice. How are the subs doing? They're probably getting really beaten up. Ludwig, you have anything else? Any other upgrades yet? Nope. Oh, look at this. What's going on, Rolf? Any upgrades yet? No, that's okay. Oh, crud. Your organization just hit the bottom deck. The fall of Havana, the Americans repeat history. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, look. That's what you get. That's what you bloody get. Sunk both carriers again. Oh, boy. Oh, there's so much lag. I can't even do anything. Oh, yeah. We're going to lose a couple ships here, maybe. Nope. Yeah, go ahead. Repair, repair, repair. That was another great naval battle. Sinking any carriers, any enemy carriers, is always a great thing. All right, up here, you guys might be able to do pretty darn well. Cuba severs, or yeah, severs trade ties. The Cuban government, ostensibly in solidarity with socialists, the world or in the world now, have suspended all trade with their nation. I mean, that makes sense. They just capitulated. So, go ahead and go crazy. We want to link up with the Portuguese over there, or as close as we possibly can. Good. Now, move, move, move. We're making our lines stronger and better. Cool. Next up, where we would attack once that division moves out, maybe. Or we attack right here. Send half you guys that way. Awesome. And we're still out of manpower. Hmm. Out of manpower, out of fuel. This is not a good combo. There you go. A little bit of momentary manpower. Just in case. Nice, very nice. We don't have air superiority, which makes sense. I could save a little bit more on manpower if I convert some of these divisions to... Uh, other division templates. Use more artillery. We need more artillery in our guys. So, remove that. And I don't really don't feel bad about doing this just because I have plenty enough. Well, we're going to get enough army XP anyways. Get a little bit more manpower. Not much, but it is what it is. And actually, which template that we are currently using that has plenty of artillery on it? Let's see, we've got almost 4,000 things of artillery in there. Divisions, mid artillery. Good. Tried and true. Last one. Oh, goodness. That's not good. Um, now we have a massive artillery deficit. That, that may maybe a little bit too many. You guys are... What I just made. Convert you guys. Uh, no, not with the tanks. I think one is garbage. Yeah, that's fine. Switch you guys back. Just so that this is not as... Impacted, we'll say. Yeah, we'll do that. Field guns, good. Artillery guns. Nice. We got plenty of that stuff. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, just do everyone for that. You will gain manpower and a little bit of artillery. That's fine. That's fine. Because when I hit them, or they hit us, we're going to hit them really flipping hard. So time to go on a little bit more. We do need time to go on so that we can uh, get fuel and stuff like that. Let's get better rifles because we do have a surplus, and that's good to do when you have a surplus. Lost a couple guys. We're about to get radio, which is cool. Come on, get another ship fleet in here. We're losing screens. We're losing screens. Thank you. Yep, we lost more screens because I don't know what what, what are you guys doing. Like, seriously, are you just, like, sitting there waiting for our ships to die or something? Like, this ain't cool. I mean, these guys have to repair. That makes sense. And these guys have to repair as well, but, man, come on. Radar. Let's get some better research speed. That's that's really important to do. It's amazing to see what the AI has done so far. The AI is special. 
So they don't want to attack me. You know, they go to war with me. And yet they don't attack me. Doesn't make any sense. Oh, but they do invade Spain. Holy crap. That's probably why. If that's the case, you know what? Oh, wait. Why are you guys attacking? I don't remember telling you to attack. Maybe I forgot to turn off the order, though. Huh. You, you, you're just wasting lives now. That's not good. Well, for the most part, you're just wasting lives. Just hold, just hold. This is okay, though. I don't mind this. That's kind of nice. Let's get to those boys. Good. How's this looking? Hmm. White Ruthenians can't do very much. That's good. Half of you guys are going to attack, and the other half is going to support the attack. You all can come here. Good. Let's see, where else can we attack? That's not bad. I'm going to wait for the Italians to finish there. Oh, we lost an allied thingy. That's fine. Whatever. Let's see. Fuel, of course. Iran, please. Just give me the fuel. Arabia. Soviet. German East Asia. Yeah, that's not bad. Could be worse. Prove oh, oh, oh. That's not good. Whatever. Are they trying a naval invasion? Maybe not. Nice. You actually won there. Great job, guys. Great job. Every tile counts. Anything else around here? You definitely need more artillery. Actually, we're doing really well in artillery. Actually, we're doing really, really well. But we need, oh god, we need more naval bombers. Do that, too. Yeah, just need more fuel. I mean, production-wise, we're actually doing pretty darn well. Ah, yes, thank you, Kaiser. Other Kaiser Carl. You know what, if you could just help out here, that'd be amazing. You should be able to win. Come on, let time go on a little bit more so we can get more research done. Good. How are you not winning here? Get Pinsk if you can, man. If we went up there, we can definitely smash these guys over here. Ah, the Bazukov. Give me some good results. I need good results. How is Sweden doing, actually? We've done pretty well with the Portuguese invading them. They've done a really good job. Good. Anywhere else? That looks really weak right here. But our line should probably not attack there. You guys, except for you guys, except for you guys, and you are going to attack right there. Help support the attack. Of course, it's not always optimal to attack with infantry because eh, we can have some pretty big losses. Pretty big old losses. And the Qing Empire's gone. Well, China's. Definitely Feng Qing now. Much more Feng Qing. Hmm. Oh, they have decrypted our stuff. Oh, yeah, Feng Qing. Yeah, yeah. Come on, boys. Come on in. Now, next focus. Rubber. Oh, we get more stability. Stability would be nice. It does help us just a little bit more for more organization, huh? Actually, how close are we... Oh yeah, I would definitely want to do Embrace Synthetic Rubber. With increasing demand of rubber skyrocketing prices, we should remind the world that the first synthetic rubber was created in the Bayer Laboratories in Elberfield, and as such we can employ the minds of our chemists to further refine the methods of creating it to augment our sources of natural rubber. Now, I want that, because even though we need rubber, we don't need a ton of rubber right now, it's going to become very, very important very soon, so we can make more tanks. And planes. And planes. Do never forget about those planes. Send, oh, thank God we do not no, no longer send aid to the Ukraine. Thank goodness. We can actually spend it on ourselves to make sure that we have a better army uh, uh, production group. You can still probably win here too, actually. Now, attacking over the river, not optimal, but whatever. Uh, the Marine Division is already good because I made a... Actually, why are you not attacking? You need to get in that mess right now. You're, that's over a river. That is the absolute perfect time for you to attack. Come on, you guys got this. You guys got this. I know I should really be doing encirclements, but it's a little difficult with infantry. We're we getting navally invaded somewhere? Western approaches. Oh, we're just getting attacked then. That's just that's just normal stuff. Cool, cool. Oh, oh, they are trying to land. But I mean that I'm kind of okay with that. I'm really disappointed that the French don't attack more. Like they like I said earlier, like it doesn't make any sense. You go to war with me, but you don't attack. That that's not very logical. Like I understand like if 
You shouldn't attack in some areas, but some other areas you should like you should be able to figure that out. I don't know, it just seems very odd. Very odd. Good, we'll have that tile. We'll have some more tiles down here very soon. Uh, actually, could you help attack here? No. You have to attack here. So you're actually okay doing all of that. And then you're okay with that. And then you're okay with attacking there as well. Why are they so weak on the front line? I guess... How many divisions does Russia have? I don't know. I should probably figure out what they're doing. They have a little bit of manpower. They're on free trade. They're on a limited, limited conscription. They have 158 divisions, which is... Not as strong as I thought Russia would be, but, you know, whatever. I still, like I said before, I need anti-tank, but there's so many things I need to research now that it's not even funny, really. It's a little joke. A little joking, you know? A little, a little, a little, a little funny, you know? Ha ha ha. Ha <laughs> ha. Good, good, good. Finland is falling. Let time go on as we continue to do some naval stuff, even though... Shippies? Shippies. I know, like, you guys gotta repair, but, uh... Bruh, like... Should be done by now. Actually, is there technology where? Oh, nice. Oh, we have to get this guy done first. Where I can repair faster? Hmm. I wonder. Nice. That was another big naval battle that we didn't really keep an eye on. We lost an equal amount of destroyers, pretty much. It's not too bad. And they're still trying to naval invade me. Oh God, there's a carrier. Uh, no carriers, but just big old boys there. Sub boys. We should be able to defend pretty easily. German garrisons. Festungs. Am I making any festungs? I am making some festung divisions. Good. Alright, so how's this coming along? Capital's Minsk. We definitely want Minsk. You guys are reorganizing yourselves. Nope. Concentrate forces. Good. Now we're going to attack right there. Into the marshes probably isn't a great idea, but whatever. We got enough Ukrainian guys still here to help hold the line. And then, you know what? Kuming, national government has, been, has fallen. Cool. Take all but one. Attack there. No, they canceled the lonely snow. Oh, thank you. Yes, yes, yes. Hmm. Four divi eight divisions. I'm trying to ramp up my attacks more on the uh, enemies here. One division there. Our artillery, we're almost out of our deficit, which is amazing. I don't want to attack into a fort with... Oh. Oh, boy. How did I miss that? Oh, I didn't miss that because they took that over earlier. Yeah, don't let them do that, guys. That's a bad idea. That's a really, really bad idea. Alright, not bad. Oh, boy. Good. Mm -hmm. Oh, and... Nice. Good. In progress. Alright, alright, alright. Uh, we're probably going to be both of you doing this. Your intel networking forced into hiding time. Marco? Polo? Let's see, really, Rush is where we want to be at. Because we want to capitulate them first. Alright, so you guys are on, on a mission, which is fine. Which means we'll get less intel on the Union of Britain, which is fine, whatever, no one cares. Good. I'm surprised the Russians. Oh, wait, oh, I guess the Russian army isn't that big, but. Like, come on, guys. I was expecting a little bit more, please. Please. Push. Especially White Ruthenia. They're not doing that great. They rebelled against us. But they're not really doing that great. Alright, let's see. Some, some convoys. Good. It's actually, for our generals, does anyone have upgrades? That's a good question to ask. No. We haven't been in that, many, that much action anyway, so. They didn't really expect, it, expect us to have too much action. You guys can help out down there. It is three divisions, so that's going to take a while to take those guys out. Good, good. Begin an attack. Losses in this war so far. We've lost quite a few guys. Makes sense. And they've ended their hostilities. Rocky Mountain Ceasefire, which doesn't make any sense. Oh, they joined the Entente. Now that makes sense. That's actually really good for them. We've killed over 100,000 Russians, which is nice. Well, for some people. Uh, yes, PSA, yes. Actually, who are they led by? I never know. Oh boy. That is... Good luck. At least now they join the Entente. Canada might help take out the syndicates, but... Hiram Johnson. Hmm. Hmm. Good. Oh, oh, hold on. We finally have the French attack. They're trying to thrust themselves into Belgium. 
I'm glad we have an extra stockpile of resources because we're actually not doing great over here. That is not bueno. We're doing okay enough on the eastern front. If I have to bolster forces on this front, that's fine. That is fine. Hmm. How many divisions are we getting attacked by? Just a casual 21 right there. I'm starting to win in there. That's good. The French have woken up. Ever since they kicked out some of those uh, French Republicans, they're doing okay. Pl what? Please, no one attack. I don't think we're attacking, but for the love of God, please do not attack. Alright. Uh, I'm feeling pretty good about that right now. You guys don't attack when you don't need to attack. You guys are attacking when you need to attack. Uh, let you guys get a little bit more strength first. Looks like we've got a little bit of logistical problems here. Which makes sense, of course. You guys take half you guys. Take that. That's a good border area for the river. Um, what's going on over here? Oh, we lost a couple guys. Oh, but we sunk a couple guys, too. Nice. Good stuff. Nice. Come over there. Come up behind the Russians. Got another Festung division. Good. Cancel the Lendlease. So be it. So be it. So be it. Good. We're actually holding on the line, which is exactly what I imagined. Especially with Von Bayern here, who is a very good defensive type of guy. Hmm. We just researched something. What was it? I hope it was synthetic refineries. Because I have, I have the industry to do that now. Yes, it was. Great. We're going to get even more fuel gain from them. I know I could do more gun stuff. I could do other stuff. But I got to get more fuel right now. Make sure our navies are doing okay. And actually, I'm going to get rid of that one. Yes. You guys are going to come right there. Right there. And then... <sighs> Hanover. So be it. Like, we're going to get a lot of, a lot of fuel. Hopefully soon-ish. Ish. Cool. And the more ships we lose, I guess it's the less fuel that we need. Which is... It's a good consolation prize. Are they attacking in Italy? No, they're not. They're death stacking. We're death stacking in Italy as well. Let these guys get a little bit more uh, entrenchment, more planning, so they can move out. What can we do here? Not much. Free trade, export focus, limited exports would honestly probably be good to do. Eh, actually we're okay. I mean, I just think more, we would get more fuel, but it wouldn't really matter very much. Uh, I guess I'll just wait for a little longer. Industrial concerns. Mil oh, that's actually pretty good. Crop. Ooh, that's actually looking pretty good as well. We're low on manpower, which makes sense. We'll see what happens when we get that. Yeah, sure, sure. I have no problems with the on top. Hey, look, they tried to invade again, but they didn't take a port. That's a bad idea. God dang, they're really trying to kill us here. Oh, we're probably going to lose Dunkirk. That is not ideal. But they can't break us through this part behind Dunkirk, which is okay. And I'm still using mul Why am I using mul No wonder you're losing. There you go. If you need to retreat, you pull that off. There you go. So they don't just attack all willy-nilly. Because that's really bad. Oh, okay. Uh, who's repairing imports? Or get another good look at the naval screen. You know, I am going to throw you in there now. Are you all repairing? Oh my goodness. And moving to a signed fleet area. Good, good. Got, got two more task forces, two more ships. Awesome. The Chateau Salines. Too bad this you can't like. <laughs> I oh look at that. That's interesting. Very interesting. But uh, <clears throat> I was thinking like these aren't pirate ships. You can't just like steal enemy ships, right? Eh, that'd be kind of funny if you could. That'd be actually kind of cool. Get more Monsk. That would cut off all their supplies in there. That's good. Good. I want Minsk. I really, really fucking want Minsk. And we're going to need to get some logistic companies on top of anti-tank. On top of other things as well. But I don't have the resources for that. Even having five research slots is still not enough. <clears throat> Good, good. Oh, did they push us? No, they did. I don't think they pushed us. It's this over a river, which is a bad idea, but there's only two divisions. They're not even fully organi organized. That should be okay. Oh, look at that. Yes, sink them, sink them, sink them, sink them harder. Good. Oh, it's two subbies, boys. We lost. That's not good. I should make more subs. I should do a lot of things. Oh, well. Good. <clears throat> Up here, we could probably win. Let's do that. Let's let that militia division move out first. Good. Attack. Can all of you guys attack right here? Yes. 
You might be able to win, you might not. <clears throat> Deficit of artillery is looking okay. Gun-wise, we can probably lower this by five. Gives a couple more fighters, perhaps. A couple more light tanks. I really don't want to be making light tanks. Holy crud, how many different types of light tanks did you make? Do we... Yeah, I said minus 9,000. like, holy crud. Uh, pump you up by 10. Lower you by 5. Cool. More divisions. Good. They're attacking us on this front. So, give... Put everyone over there. Castle ring. Good. Infantry expert. Now, they're really trying to attack us here. That's not ideal. Where are you guys going? Uh, send one guy... That, uh, send one guy that way. Because these guys are getting beaten up pretty harshly. Looks like we're getting just a little bit more fuel. We're doing a great job so far over here. Embrace a synthetic rubber. Oh, I, yes, I will. Nice. Actually, come down here and smash that division. Okay, next up. Synthetic resources always is very nice. Expanding band... Babelsberg for a little bit more stability sounds pretty good, though, too. The Babelsberg's film studios have long replaced Hollywood as the most influential film industry of the new world, or the world in peri period. However, on movies as far removed from politics as possible is anything but supportive of the state. Some producers, namely Lenny Riefenstahl, have proposed some projects that, with our funding, could remind the Germans of their glorious past and future. And don't forget about the future. The future is kind of important as well. Oh, God, what's going on around here? Let's see. Yeah, those. That's, that's an attack. Did they, oh, they actually pushed us back over here, too. That is... I'm glad to put deploy some more infantry around here. That's good. Let's see. So, you guys. I might be able to convert to infantry with artillery. We'll gain... Actually, some artillery. We'll need some more support equipment. Actually, oh, wait. No. Well, so, actually, some of you guys are 40 combat with already. That's fine. Just convert them out of whatever they already were. You guys are 20 combat width, which is not ideal. We're going to need more artillery pieces. That is actually okay, because we're going to get attacked across the entire line eventually, so... Whatever. Cool. Cool. Good. Come on, French Republic. I know you lost a couple times already. Just do it again. Ooh. Tanks? Research speed, armor... Hmm. Oh, we could do some ship stuff. We can make more cruisers, but nah. Planes, infantry stuff. Ooh, we haven't done Mauser contracts. More breakthrough for infantry would be pretty good. More soft attack is pretty good. More general stuff. Breakthrough and soft attack is pretty awesome. Ooh, that looks really good, though. Just make more infantry equipment. We're, we're already good with that stuff. Mechanized, or we go with this. Chemical companies. My goal is to make Germany... Free of foreign oil. So. Oh man, look at that. Plus 20% to military construction speed. Holy crud, that's awesome. Resource, resource gain efficiency, plus 15%. Uh, oh, we have crop again. Two crops. Monopole. I'm going to go with BASF. So that gives us more synthetic resources, research speed, industrial research speed, and then refinery construction. That's exactly what I want. Oh, and the Russians have invaded us. Huh. Well then. Hmm. I need someone to take these guys out. The Swedes might be able to do that. Let's watch the Swedes and see what they do first. And because of that, we have just a tiny bit more oil, so... Or fuel. I'm gonna go do this as well. Reactivate you guys. That'd be fine. They're still attacking us. Like, oh, they're even attacking us in the middle of the line. That is... That is something. That is ballsy. Over a river, too. Quite a few guys over there. We got a little bit of fuel, so I'm feeling okay about this. Could have made a really bad joke there, but I'm not going to. I ain't gonna. You guys might do okay there. Yeah, need the port. Please, take the port if possible. Oh, this is gonna... This is not looking very good. You can... Come up there and then help out. Actually, just help out right now. That'll be fine. Oh, look at that. Yeah. Yeah, guys. I could use some help. Yeah. Yeah, the Swedes should have that taken care of, but we'll see what happens. Good. Another Russian sub. Gone. How is this front looking? It's... it's. I don't understand why it's 
surprisingly easy against the Russians right now. Of course, then again, I don't play a lot of Kaiser Reich. So, it is what it is. You're going to smash here, and then we go to Minsk, and then call it an episode, probably. If we can do that. If we can take out White Ruthenia, that'd be amazing. That'd be awesome. Oh, up, oh, and there goes fuel. Plenty of guns, though. Plenty of guns. Anyone have other fuel stops they can give me? No. Iran. Iran. You have even less than before. What the heck? Oh, look. Sounds like naval invasions. Cool, cool, cool. Hey, look. We, we're winning now. We're there. We lost this tile, which is really not optimal. Go ahead. Everyone here, hold. Select all. Oh, do that. Hold. Do not attack. Do not attack. We want to bleed the French dry. Where is the French? There they are. They've lost half a million to us. I mean, that's insane. That's that's that's, that's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Got a lot of divisions. That's got a good amount of manpower, though. All oh, right. What else? What else is going on here? Cool. Oh, we actually sunk something. Nice. We sunk two destroyers. Thank you, close air support. I appreciate you and your efforts. Actually, you guys can probably just help out right there. There you go. We'll probably leave one division here, though, to help support the attack. Get you, help support the attack. Wow, we got a lot of good air XP, naval XP, all sorts of good stuff. You guys gotta hold out, man. You gotta hold out. What the, the division... Oh, you're 40 combat with, and you're still getting beaten back? Holy crud. Now, which one is a 40 combat with division? Ooh, look at that. That's pretty awesome. Let's grab this, because we need it immediately. Oh, oh, ooh, ooh, that's not good. Grab that. We still have enough of an industry to do whatever we need to do. Um, yeah, which, which template is 40 combat with? Infantry? It's probably near the... Oh, no. Garda? Because I, I just wanted to name it 40 combat with. Yeah, I, I, don't, I hate militia. They're just waste manpower. Template 9, this is it. Big boys. There you go. Now we can understand. They're these guys. Some of these guys are big boys. Uh, big boys. Yeah. Good. I really don't want to lose Belgium. If anything, I really don't want to lose them. It's like all you're all going to become big boys. Oh, there's their fleet again. Nice. We're still trying to get Minsk, of course. Anywhere else? Yes, right here. We lost last time. The Russians are looking pretty strong. It looks like the Ukrainians tried to attack a little bit, which is not ideal. Hmm. Oh, they actually took a board. Great. They invaded again. Good, good, good. While we're busy dying over here, um, they're trying to attack, which is awesome. They've lost still. 550,000 men. Not enough. It is never enough. Some of these guys look really bad, but it's just because of our artillery deficit. And we just try to upgrade them a little bit more. Good. Give them more of that. Tungsten. Do that. That's fine. Good. We won again, it looks like. Ah, oh, the Finns have capitulated. Nice. We actually accomplished something in this episode. We made an enemy nation capitulate. With, of course, the help of some Entente buddies. Ooh, look at that. That does not look ideal for you, man. That ain't looking good. Oh, if you could just get in Murmansk. Please. Thank you. Take the airbase so they can't use it. You three. Attack so they can't do anything. Now, light tanks. Now, what type of light tank? Eh, that's 20 combat with. They might be able to win here. They, oh, they can pierce me, though. That makes sense. So, this is on a little tighter. I like it tight. Nice. Good. We sunk another one of those bad boys. They're still trying to attack us. Good. We're out of fuel once again. Come on, make these things faster. They're almost done. We get just a little bit more fuel. Oh, please do not attack. For the love of God, please do not attack. Why are you attacking that way? Hold. Good. Minsk. Oh, they desperately don't want to lose this area. Which I understand, but too bad. Too bad. I want that tile. We need that tile. Mm, right here, it looks pr 
pretty optimal as well. Could you win there? Maybe not, since these guys are moving north anyways. Yeah, you might be able to. Oh, the Ukrainians are... I called them in. Good. More pressure. More pressure. And the <laughs> Republican French... God dang it, guys. Come on, man. How are you guys doing? You're doing okay? I'm glad you Canada didn't give back New England. Oh, look at that. A finished sub. Play and loss. So be it. Wow, we're really not winning up here at all. You guys hold... How are you not winning over there, at least? This is, gives me confusion. They're not re they're really not that strong up here. Should be able to win right there. Maybe we lost another sub, but, you know, what else is new? What else, what else, what else? Come on. Battle for Minsk is raging hard. They got, they're trying to defend some horsey boys, but that ain't going to be enough for us. Cryptology. Who am I doing? Russia... I don't know why they wanted the Austrian Empire. That made no sense. Oh, we took it? We took it. And next up will be Minsk. Yeah, maybe the next video, because this video has gone on pretty long enough. It is almost, almost 1941, my friends. But this is where, unfortunately, we have to leave it today. What have we done? We capitulated the Finns with our allies. We have begun defending against it. quite the onslaught of uh, French and British folk. And we've been upgrading our divisions. And we have researched refuel refineries which we have just completed so guys hope you enjoyed today's episode if you did consider leaving a like subscribe if you're new check out my discord link in the description below and i will see you all tomorrow as we attempt to take minsk thanks for watching have a great rest of your day